Hello there guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a fishing program slash keylogger for RuneScape. Basically what that is, is um, well I'll show you. This is one I made earlier. right? As you can see it looks pretty legit for um, a RuneScape membership uh, thingy. So they'll type their username, their password and the password come up in stars. They will choose the month. But what they don't know is when they click submit it will send to my email. But as you can see, there's nothing in my email so far. So when I click submit, a message box appears saying this, and okay. They'll just think, hmm, it's not worked in 45 minutes. So something must not be wrong. But as you can see, it's sent directly to my email. <laughs> Pretty cool, eh? So I'm going to show you how to make this. You will need uh, Visual Basics 2010. And I'll just follow me from here. Create new project. Um, at the bottom where it says name, say if you want to make a message box like I did, and if you do, you'll you'd have to make a name here, because if not, then the message box will just come up as a Windows application one. So I type it IRS Gold Tut. Click OK. Right, as you can see, it looks pretty like nothing. So um, we're going to insert uh, two labels and two text boxes right click on the first level change it to username click on the second label change it to password right now you just line these up so it looks nice and tidy Right, let's preview this. As you can see, um, it's looking alright, I guess. But as you can see, if you type in a password, you can see it. And you can also maximize the box so it looks really fake. So, to fix this, click on the text box next to password. And at the bottom right, scroll up to where it has password character. It's underneath multi line. Uh, and type in shift and star. Now, to fix it so you can't maximize it. Click around the box, like at the top, and scroll up to where it has maximize box. It'll say true. Use the drop down box and click false. So now if I go to preview it, can't maximize it. And the password, oh, the password is just stars. So it's looking alright so far, I guess. Now, uh, if it's going to be a RuneScape Gold Generator, add a label. Change it to like gold. Line it up. Um, now insert a text box. No, sorry, not a text box. A radio button. One or two. But I'm just going to say two for now, but you know. I'm going to change that to 100 mil. Change that to 200 mil. Oh, yeah. Uh, also change the name of the box. So I'll put RS Gold. Uh, so that's looking pretty alright at the moment, I guess. Now, insert two buttons. This is important. You follow my steps. Uh, where the buttons? This is going to be your cancel button and the send button. So, button one, change it to submit. Or oh, anything you want. Button two, cancel. Now we're going to insert it a background so it looks more realistic. So to click around the box again, go to where it says background image, press the little three hours and import. And uh, I made one for this video. Where is it? There it is. Just click OK. Uh, there's my gold. Right, let's just leave it like that. Now, as you can see, let's preview now. Looking pretty legit so far, I must say. But by the way, uh, if you're ever looking for one of these online, do not download them because they are fake. Not a virus, but they're fake. I've made a few a RuneScape Gold one and a, um, whatchamacallit, and a membership one, and I've scammed so many people with it. Gained about like 60 odd mil from it. Um, okay, 
this is important you double click on submit highlight everything and click delete now I'll put this link in the description uh, it's code in the description copy it and paste it into here right this is important you need to put your gmail account here oh hold on a second there's batteries running a bit flew bear with me guys right. anyway it's important your gmail account mine is callum 596 at g gmail.com make sure it's inside the bracket so it's pink like that or red for your second email this is important this is where the actual email will be sent to you so mine is callum 596 at hotmail.co.uk and you put your gmail there and your gmail password right to make it so the cancel button works oh sorry the double click on cancel and click and just type in close and enter right so let's preview it so far as you can see if I press close cancel it will close it which is you know pretty good uh, type your name hello Click the gold you want, click submit, that will send to the email which you put in. So right, now to make a message box, double click on submit, type in MSG B O X, enter. Now inside the brackets, type in pop uh uh, uh the, the speech marks, type in um success log in in 45 minutes then speech marks right and press enter now if we look at it and oh where's that gone there it is now oh for god's sake sorry guys now if i type in hello hello and choose the one i want in fact hold on i'll Nah, I was gonna. I might do it so it actually, you know, sends to me email. So no, fact, no. Wait, yes. Hold on a sec. I was gonna show you like if it worked, but you know, I can't risk it in case of clicking it back. So then I'll have to edit it, and I can't be asked. So when you click submit, as you can see, that is the uh, the thing you put up when you first created it. When I first created it, I made that name. So and when you click submit, this box will pop up, and it should, you know, go into your um your email account straight away so that's how you make a phishing website well a phishing program so if you liked it uh, like comment subscribe favorite and shit and i'll um, make some more you know sooner or later so thanks for watching and goodbye